Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 and our Smash the Patriarchy campaign. We are continuing to uh, try and get a corrupted priest into the papacy. Uh, unfortunately, the next, uh, the Preferatus, uh, kind of stormed out and, and was not uh, a big fan of that. Um, oh, wait, no. I did. I thought that was... Is that a different guy? It may have been. I don't know. Uh, I see that Count Knud has had his uh, um, score decrease. Still can't assassinate him, though. I could taint to touch him. Nah, that's fine. He's fairly old anyway. Uh, I, myself, am 33. I do have a, a genius husband. But I am still trying to get a stupid claim on the duchy here. And you've died. Comatose in bed. That's fine. I don't care. Maybe I should go for uh, Ravenna or Ancona or something then. Can I still not nominate my son? Still cannot nominate my son. I've risen so fast that other people regard me with envy. Could they be any more envious? Uh, sure. Proves am of ambition. We'll go for that. Pretty sure you're ending your plot, so that's fine. Alright, the Pope has died. My liege, my work in Lombardy seems to have come to fruition. By bribing, cajoling, extorting, threatening, and forging documents, I've managed to fabricate a claim on the County of Lombardy, presently held by... I don't want the County! Uh, Alright, let me think about that. Um... All right, the Pope has died, and he has been succeeded by Sylvester, who is not someone that I... He's not the person that I expected. What happened to you? Weren't you the... Maybe that was the one who I tried to con corrupt. Well, let's go ahead and corrupt you. How old are you? You're 50. Alright, so do I want to just take this, uh, the county? Um. I mean, I gotta expand. Yep. Yeah. Alright, next up. Where do I want to go? Uh, well, those two... What else is part of Lombardy? Oh, quite a bit. Well, if I got Cremona or Pavia... Alright, well, for now, let's go to Pisa. And... Uh, when that's done, uh, when this war is done, I'll see what I'd be able to get. You are leading troops in Nevers. I don't know why. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Declare war. Claim Lombardy. Everyone will agree. Let's go around this way. <laughs> Stay away from the French troops. That seems wise. All 
All right, let's see. Oh, you are a kinslayer. Wow. And a known murderer. Uh, turn your guilty pleasures into vices. Satan can empower me. I really do not like how uh, tough it can be to get anything done with the, uh, um, the papacy. It's really a pain. So you're going to Parma. Alright, you're gonna have a defensive bonus, but that's fine. I outnumber you. Although I did not have a leader there. The things I do for Satan. Over the course of the celebrations, Cardinal Amory's ego inflated to, like a bloated cow. He has already become insufferable to be around, but at least he was exceedingly grateful that I finally recognized his greatness. Who else can I uh, try to do whatever to? Uh, okay, you are... Alright, I've already freed your depravity. I plot to kill you. <sighs> Not really. Wow, holy cow, that is... I am getting a lot of these uh, eunuchs. Uh, you... You are a pretty good uh, military leader, and a siege leader at that. Let's see, you've got uh, narrow flank, morale damage, uh, morale defense, defense, defense... I think I'll swap you. There we go. Olivia's raised too long. It's fine. Songs of Anguish? Sure. Let's invite him over. Gain some more dark power. Tainted Soul is but a small price to pay. I gain Possessed. In the chaos of battle, you've managed to corner Bishop Camillo. He resisted bravely before they slew him. Good riddance. Uh, let's see. Uh, the time has come for the child of Satan to enter this world and lead us to a new area of power. Area? I think it's supposed to be era. Of power and glory. The choice of the lucky mother falls upon you, honorable priestess. So, accept submission, spawn of Satan. On a... Right-click on a female follower of Sa Satan of childbearing age in your court and select Unholy Impregnation. Well, I think we know who we're going to be choosing. Do it! I whispered the words of the summoning spell even though I wanted to shout them at the night sky. The greatest honor was about to be mine. As the final syllables passed through my lips, I shut my eyes and waited in silence, my heart pounding hard with excitement. A warm hand gently squeezed my shoulder. And so it is done. This battle is actually taking quite a long time. Wow, seriously? I got the Duke already? Nice. I'll take it. Thank you. Alrighty. So, Lombardy is now ours. Um, we've got a Baron here who is German. Attempt to abduct. 
I have put the word out among my brethren in Lucifer's own. When an opportunity presents itself, the brothers and sisters in Lombardy will attempt to snatch Baron Otobono and bring him to me in chains. Excellent. This might take a while. Uh, Benozia. Nope. Learn on your own. Alright, so you are... No, that's fine. He's created the title Duchy of Genoa, huh? Hmm, interesting. Should probably fabricate in Pavia next. Unless he moves his uh, capital. Uh, let's see, half-sister. Nope, learn on your own. There goes the uh, illness. Ah, oh, I did lose. Uh, I got minor depopulation here now. That is disappointing. All right, let's go ahead and uh, try to abduct this guy, approve the scheme. All right, so for some reason it's still showing that that guy is. Whatever, let's sacrifice him. Hell Satan, only got ten. I've inherited the barony of Lodi from Baron Otobono of Lodi. Okay, so now I have nine out of seven. Um, but I could give this to a an actual Italian. Or keep it for myself and give out other things. Uh I don't really need to. All right, let's see who we've got. Vassals, load filter, slot three, get rid of genius. All right, we don't need to convert this county, uh, although Genoa is converted to German. That's unfortunate. That's Norman. So is that. I will definitely need to free our Italian brethren down there eventually. Um, what do we want? So there's an 11, 12, 10, 15, 22. Yeah, you know what? You can have it. There we go. All right, nothing else uh, jumping out at me as very interesting. Any other things that I want to uh, pop up. Um, tolerance is not spreading, so I could always bump that up. Noble Customs is not spreading. That might actually be a good thing. Tolerance would allow me to unlock the significant status of women. Town infrastructure and church infrastructure are not spreading, but I don't really care that much about those. Light infantry is not spreading. We wouldn't be able to pass this uh, right away. Women related to the ruler are allowed to hold the office of chancellor and steward. That would be a chancellor, steward, and a marshal. Allow change of gender preference laws. All right, well, I, I think we need to. I think we do want to work on that. So yeah, let's bump that up. Oh dear, I must be with child. Will my husband believe it is his? Good news, darling. Tell a white lie to him, Marios. 
Uh, let's see, what do you want? No, stop trying to kill that guy. I can hold a feast. I think I need to wait until depopulation is gone before I can uh, really do anything. Also, uh, oh, cupbearer. Um, here, Piombino, you can be the cupbearer. So next month I can move him. Uh, let's see. Can make her brave, that's fine. Mint the coins for glory. Your physician, Ercole, has been asking for permission to travel to the hospital in Florence to study there for a time. He will need some financing to cover the costs for the journey and for staying at the hospital. D it's my own county! Excellent suggestion. 16 gold? Sure. <laughs> I get that back immediately. What are you doing now? What the hell did you do? Well, I'm not going to imprison him right now. I don't know what the hell he did. A rumor about a spy sneaking around in my own castle was confirmed this morning when I caught him red-handed. I'm not concerned. Gain 10 piety. Behead him! Gain 2 martial. Wouldn't be so bad. Uh, the Temple Vassal opinion would go my, down by 2. I will kill him with my bare hands. Or carve out his eyes because I have the Roth trait. Intrigue plus 2. Ooh, I'll take that. I'll take, my, uh, I'll take an intrigue boost. How does that, uh... <laughs> yes! I'm next in line! So... Uh... Earl Wallen the Cruel... How would you... Ooh, you have cancer. Oh, it would be such a terrible, terrible thing for you to die, but I can't do that. Um... Shucks. Doesn't look like I can do much with him. I'm sad. Your physician, Ercole, came back from his stay at the hospital today. He explained in great detail about the various conditions and ailments at the, and the remedies which uh, to use for them. You did not understand half of it, but in short, he seems to have learned a great deal. Excellent. He gains two learning. Nice. Your steward has collected a special tithe in Florins. Fantastic. Okay, 1,000 gold. Um, what should I build? Pike training grounds. Go with that. I like that. Also, uh, we no longer have depopulation, so next time I get a uh, summer fair, I'll go ahead and hold one. The Chancellor of Tunis. Oh, whatever. Lord Mayor of Tunis. Oh, okay. That bastard. All right. So how are we doing with uh? How are we doing with the? Uh... Okay. We still. The next expected successor. Alright, let's go ahead and start the plot. And... Is there anyone who... No. I can't kidnap him either. Right, well, maybe people will join in. There we go, hold a summer fair. Let's go ahead and do that. All right, well, I can throw him into the prison. Didn't really pay attention to that. Let's go back to uh, trying to fabricate on uh, Rome. Introduce heir to the realm. Let's go ahead and do it. They will be here soon. A son was born to Duchess Matilda II of Tuscany and an unknown father named Vittore. 
Um, well, we, we clearly need to uh, come up with a, a, an appropriate name. Lucifer. But I don't think that I can... Uh, legitimize him. Oh, I can. Uh, Ercole, you must attempt to save my Lucifer. Go ahead and give you a struggle. That's fine. Finally, he is here. As I look down at the sickly, brilliant face of my little son, I truly feel that everyone I, everything I had to do to bring this moment into existence was worth it. Only time will reveal what powers his demon blood has granted him, but I anticipate great things to come. Hail Satan! Gain 1,000 dark power! Holy cow! Yes! Totally gonna legitimize him. Now, uh, I cannot, I cannot drain your life yet. I need to become, uh, the head of the society. Three seventy-three. I am definitely going to be, uh, the head of the society once, you know, this fool dies. Can someone kill him? No, not really. He does have cancer, though. As Asmodeus introduces himself to Bishop Giulio of Chieti, he not only presents himself with grace, but also manages to impress Giulio by skillfully complimenting him. I taught him everything he knows. It seems as if whatever treatment Urkel administered worked. Little Lucifer is much better. Now he appears no different than other children his age. God be praised... God? 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 What are you... <sighs> Alright, maybe I'm doing this in front of uh, Air Cole. The Summer Fair brings all kinds of entertainers to Florence, and a puppet show got my attention when I heard the giggles, laughter, and wolf whistles from its audience. After watching the show for a while, I realized that one of the characters was supposed to be me. Let me try it! Well, because I'm gregarious. I get a uh, nice opinion boost with someone. It seems as if Asmodeus has started to get along incredibly well with the child of one of the visiting vassals. Indeed, apparently Asmodeus and Corradino have are becoming fast friends. Okay. How lovely. And suddenly that kid is a disaster. It's fine, whatever. It was fun while it lasted. Count Lazaro of Parma is a renowned fighter and tactician. After having introduced himself to Asmodeus, Lazaro approaches you with an offer. Lazaro is willing to spend some time teaching Asmodeus how to fight in exchange for your favor. Um, eh, sure. It is evidently clear to all the visiting vassals that Asmodeus has been infatuated with Count Tibaldo's wife, Princess Dorothea. While harmless, Asmodeus is still following her around like a dog. Tibaldo does not seem to be amused. She is a princess of the Holy Roman Empire. There's no time for this nonsense. And that kid is a disaster again. As Asmodeus introduces himself to Mayor Leonello Perugia, uh, okay, he's got an opinion boost with that. Liege's council's discontent did, uh, I think we have a new... Holy Roman Emperor. Adam the Confessor. He uh, does not like me all that much, because I am I am kind of a known Satanist. But he likes me because I'm a poet. Ooh, he uh How much would that be? Five hundred and fifty. No, never mind. All right, vassal opinion plus four. That's good. I'll support the carpenters. 
I want my claim. Nope. Nope. Not, not educating my son with you. Get the hell away from there. Ruler title revocation sovereignty law. Oh, I don't like that. We can hold a feast. Anyone yet? No. Alright, we still have this guy as the uh, likely successor, at least. I can appoint a new commander. Hmm. Well, defense and morale defense might be pretty good, so I'll go we'll stick with that. Asmodeus is developing into an ambitious young man. Um, yeah. On the chance that I play him, I mean, I do have a demon child, but I'm not sure if he's a if he's a, a standard demon child, um, triggering the the demon child event chain. Okay, Benozia has come of age. She's okay-ish. Uh, ambitious? Okay. Can I... I'd marry you off. King of Scotland? No. Bergslagen? I kind of want a decent alliance see, Austria. Does Austria have anything that I want? No, Austria is a whole whopping one county, it looks like. Oh, no, they have uh, parts of Holstein up there. Uh, Flanders? Moray, Bergslagen, Amosos... Brunswick. Brunswick is usually pretty big. Yeah. Alright, there we go. And my half-sister has uh, come of age now. She's better. Diligent. Excellent. Except the betrothal. Don't care about that. Alright. Uh, what about a marriage with you? Now I could go for Austria. But Zealand. No, you're just a count. I don't want a count. I want dukes. You've got cancer, so you're out. Uh, Flanders is in Fran France. Um, I might still be able to get him in. Alright. Uh, into a war if I need to. Uh, let's see. Form alliance. Nope. Alright, so that might be a little bit iffy, but we'll see. Betrothed can marry. Wow. Right away. All right. Do you want to form an alliance? No. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, 
We are still trying to get our uh, corrupted priest onto the papal throne, uh, which is not exactly going as quickly or as easily as I would have liked. Um, is quite unfortunate. And we are making only very slow headway towards uh, getting Italy, uh, which is very annoying. My people are just not fabricating the, cr the claims that I need. And he's supposed to have a really high percentage. All right, admittedly, it's not as high as it was. I could go with you. You not a commander anymore? No, you are. But you are 19, so... Fourteen point nine, eighteen point four. Yep, let's go for it. Let's do it. I don't care if I fired him. All right, when we come back, we will uh, hopefully uh, get a claim, um, a duchy title or a uh, or not. Either way. Oh, hey, uh, and Tua, you're independent. You fabricated a claim on Modena. I'm gonna try fabricating a claim on you. Oh, because Baden had all of that before, but now that he's uh, the emperor, those aren't uh, under. I mean, they're still under Baden, but he's above us. Ah, so I could get those. Well, if Ishi. It, it, not easily, I suppose. I mean, I'd still have to go fabricate claims on him. But if I got the uh, um, uh, the kingdom title, then I would be able to. But to get the kingdom title, I need more territories. Yeah, still only third. I mean, I'm still not even at forty percent yet. <sighs> it's very, very slow to fabricate these claims. Anyway, maybe we'll get something in the next episode. See you then, everyone.